Hey, Tony here. Today I'm going to do an unboxing of the Best Buy Limited Edition Trilogy for Back to the Future, so stay tuned. So today I picked up my order for the Best Buy exclusive um, steelbooks for Back to the Future. These are for the 4K release. Um, as you can see here, this does come with the 4K Ultra HD, the Blu-ray, and the digital. Here's the front and the top. And here's the spine. And here's the back. Now if you'd like to read up on all of this, you can go ahead and pause and do so. I'm going to go ahead and remove these from the package and we can take a closer look at these still books. Okay, I finally got them out of the box. It is a flimsy um, cardboard box, but it is nice that it does have some dividers in there to help keep the seal, um, to help keep these still books from scuffing up against each other. Um, but anyways, this does come with 4K Ultra HD, the Blu-ray, and the digital code. So first up, we have Back to the Future. Really nice looking artwork. So here's the front. And here's the back. Open it up. We have a loose disc. So let me set this back in here. And we have our digital code. So here it is opened up front and back. You can see the spine. And then we do have our 4K disc. And we have our Blu-ray disc. And some really nice looking inside artwork. Okay, we do have Back to the Future Part 2. Here's the front. And here's the back. Open it up. Really nice looking artwork. And we have our 4K disc. And our Blu-ray disc. And some more really nice looking inside artwork. And we have part three. Here's our front and the back. Open it up. So inside here we have our 4K disc and our Blu-ray disc. And we also have our bonus disc. Really nice looking artwork on all of these releases. And then the inside artwork. So really, really nice looking. So here's an image of all three of these still books side by side. I really like the way that this forms this larger picture of the DeLorean. Um, looks really nice. I wish we would get more still books like this. So I went ahead and I placed this back into this box. Um, it is a shame that the box wasn't a little bit um, more sturdy, but this right here will do. And I want to just take time to show you some differences between this one and the regular 4K release. This is called Back to the Future 35th Anniversary Limited Edition Trilogy with this artwork. And then just the regular 4K release is called Back to the Future, The Ultimate Trilogy with this artwork. I am going to leave this one sealed for now. Um, so anyways, so this is the difference between the two. And I also wanted to take time just to show you some of my other Back to the Future releases. I do have Back to the Future, The Complete Adventures. This right here came out a couple of years ago. It has the Blu-ray and the digital. And I also have Back to the Future, the 30th Anniversary Trilogy. Now this right here was a Zavi um, UK exclusive. I really like the artwork on this one. And also from Zavi we have um, Back to the Future, Part 2, and Part 3. And also um, there was a Target exclusive still book for the um, trilogy for the 30th anniversary edition. So overall, I'm really happy with this new release. I really do like that the three movies um, form the picture of the DeLorean. I think that's really clever. 
Please leave me a comment below. Let me know what you think about these particular Steelbook releases. Let me know if you picked up the Best Buy Steelbooks or if you just picked up the regular 4K release. Um, I'm hoping that we will get individual releases for each movie with a nice 4K slip. That would be really nice. Um, I do remember seeing Back to the Future when it um, was um, playing in theaters when it first got released. Um, I really did enjoy watching it, and I really do enjoy um, all three movies. Please leave me a comment below. Let me know what you think about the trilogy. Let me know which Back to the Future movie is your favorite. I really do enjoy reading your comments. If you like what you saw here today, please give it a thumbs up and share the video. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, I'd really appreciate it if you would subscribe. If you do subscribe, please remember to hit that notification bell so that you can be notified every time I upload a new video. If you haven't found me on my social media accounts, I'm on Facebook, Twitter, and on Instagram. And if you would like to check out what I've been watching, you can find me on Letterboxd. Thanks again for watching, and we will see you next time.